Now we have you uh, claiming that there's some document that was sent by the witness after the charges were filed uh, that apparently contained photographs. I think, I, and you can clarify the record momentarily when I'm done. Uh, that you believe goes to the credibility of this witness. So I need to ask a few questions about that, sir, to determine whether it has relevance to those issues. Number one, when did you receive this letter? I received this multiple letters, actually, over a period of time. It, it wasn't, I referred to this one because this one had the pictures. But and why do you believe one, it was from Ms. Patterson? Your question, to answer your question with clarity. Thank you. Does it have a date on it, the letter? No, I didn't bring the letter. I brought the pictures because I thought from my interpretation, I thought showing the pictures would be okay. How did, it, how did I get these? So my mind was saying, show the pictures. They didn't, they didn't come out of thin air. The witness knows the that they sent me the pictures. They know that. Well, again, it assumes facts that aren't here. You're assuming this witness sent, sent it. I don't know. But even if she did, what relevance does it have to her credibility before this jury? It goes to the credibility because she's put on this facade of being so afraid of someone, but yet still you know that we're not supposed to have contact, but you're still sneaking behind and saying, oh, I wonder how you're doing. And, oh, this and this and that. Oh, I don't think no, she's she ever said buddy. she was oh, afraid. Mm -hmm. I think that was the officers who may have uh, stated that. But I don't believe she but ever it, said that. She it, specifically said today when you asked her why did you, it was either why did you go back or why did you have a look at my notes. And she it was said, why, I don't know. It was why weren't you forthright with all the details. That was the question. So again, I'm going to ask you, even if, this letter's from her. These pictures are from her. How does it relate Honor, to her credibility before the jury? Who else could be? Who else could these pictures be from? I'm going to ask you point blank. Did you get a letter that's signed from her? I got. What do you mean signed? No How do you know? Letters. What's your belief? Why do you have a belief that they are from her? I have multiple letters from her. You're not answering my question. Why do you believe the letters are from Erica Patterson? Because they were sent from Erica Patterson. Why else would I? Were they signed by her? What do you mean signed? Did she write her name on the letter? Was are it the you, content of the letter? <clears throat> no, I'm not kidding you. I need to make a record, sir. You're making a statement that these letters are from her and that they're relevant to her credibility. Your Honor, I'm going to go out on the, on the limb and, here. And I'm asking you why you have hold that opinion. I'm, I'm going to go out on the limb here and assume which... I know it's true. You've never been in my position. You've never been in jail. So you've never received a letter from someone writing someone in jail. No one is going to suck. When you You're say not to answering me, my when question, you say to sir. This, What's this? the basis why you believe they're from Miss Patterson? Is there some information in them that you that only she would know? Did she sign the letters? Is it a, is it penmanship that you recognize? Why do you believe they're from her as opposed to somebody else sending you information? Could be your mom, why, could be, I'm just saying, could be anybody somebody, else. you got to answer my question. It's called an honor, offer of this, proof. But you still got to understand why this, this is, this is mind-boggling to me. Like how, I got a child with this woman. How would I, why would I not know her handwriting? But you have to why draw a foundation for these letters, sir. That might be this through your ridiculous. own testimony. So that I'm trying to... Figure out why you believe they're from her. Not all this other stuff about I'm in serious? jail and I have a child. I'm trying to ask, I, I need to know. It's called an offer of proof. Are you serious? What do you believe? Why do you believe they're from her? I am serious. And you because they're her. from her. But you're assuming. Like how, how else am I supposed to answer that? I've given you a few reasons why it would lend to that. Opinion. So it has to be it has to be put in a legal the term. The bottom line or is I need the letter. So if you're gonna question her on that, the state absolutely has a right to see the letter. So you you need to provide that letter. I'm not the bottom line is I'm not gonna allow any questioning without having that letter. 
So the state has the ability to question you about that or question this witness and to look at the veracity of what your claims are here. So when we, I may take an early lunch. If that's in your cell, then you can go get it and bring it. But without that letter, I'm not allowing this line of questioning. Do you have the letter with so, you in court? I just said no. Okay. How many times I got to say the same thing on, on, on record? You know, sometimes, sir, I don't hear what you say because you interrupt me so much or you answer quietly. And, and I'm taking notes and I'm focused on probably a dozen things at the same time. But if I but if I say something under my breath, everybody seems to hear it. Everybody seems to hear in that just fine. In a quiet courtroom, yes, we assumes, can hear it very and clearly. everybody assumes that it has to be disparaging once again, you're doing this tactic. Because Try to it, it's not a tactic, off of it's what facts. What we're talking it's about facts. to some other reason. It's facts. Because I, I find it hard to believe that um, I'm gonna all let of the a state, sudden nobody hears what I say. I'm going to let the state okay, make stop. a record of why they stop. believe it's objectionable because I haven't let them do that. I've given you multiple opportunities to tell me why you so believe I, it's. I didn't get these pictures from they, nobody else. Why was somebody else? The record will else? reflect you have two pictures that you believe were from this witness. That I know is from. No, that you believe. That I know. All right. I'll ask the state their position on all of this. My position, Your Honor, is that these pictures, first of all, should not be admissible. One, because of a discovery violation. We've never seen them before. Two, because we have reason to believe that he did not get them from Erica Patterson. He is on a jail phone call talking to his mother, Dawn Woods, uh, about Dawn Woods sending these photographs to him. Now, that's it, bitch.